Okay, well I'm going to teach you how to make your own logo that you can put in your Trivia Maker game using a free website called ucraft.com. Alright, I'm actually going to go to sign up and then I'm going to go ahead and fill out this info. Alright, so now that I'm signed in, I'm going to go ahead and create a logo. And let's just say that I wanted to create a logo for a game that was all about pizza. Then what I would do is I would start out with an icon and I would just type in here, go pizza, enter, see what comes up. It has about one million different icons that you can choose from. And I'm going to go with this guy right here. I'm going to drag it a little bit bigger. And then I'm going to place like that. I want a color. I'm going to go with a white. I'll go with a, like a gray just so you can see it here. Um, and then I'm going to add some text. And I'm just going to call this game Pizza Time. So then I click off, click on it again. Drag it there. Then I'm going to go change the color like that. Um, and then if I want to play with the font, I can also go down here. Roboto, we'll go with like a bold. I'll put it right there. So now I have my logo. I like it. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go like this, preview. So I'm going to generate this, generate the logo. Then we go to download right here. It's going to give us these options. All you need is the 600 pixel wide. This will do the trick. Download. And there we go. It's downloading right there. Let's go ahead and open it up. And that's what it looks like. So let's go ahead and now open up Trivia Maker. And let's say we had a pizza game that we wanted to do a custom logo. So instead of just Pizza Party, let's do this. We'll go in here. We'll go to Browse, our Downloads. Right there. And there we have Pizza Time. We'll save this. Now we get a little bit of preview, what that's going to look like. When we go to play, launch the game, and there we see, we got our logo, just like that.